Hello, hello. Welcome, everybody. Hello, everyone. Jonathan. Avi. Hello. Hello. Evening. Naum. Hello. How are you? No more in San Francisco. No. ¿Qué pasó con San Francisco? <laughs> ya se vino. Ya, ya me vine de regreso. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Okay, Edwin. Hello. Welcome. Hello. Hello, hello. Oscar. Hello, Oscar. Good morning. Alessandro, ¿cómo estamos con el micrófono? Good night, ahora, teacher. Hello, Alessandro. Ok. Bueno, vamos a estar ahí comunicando con el chat, Alessandro, porque creo que no le funciona otra vez. Ni modo, ok. Welcome everybody. Now we're going to start right now. Vamos a comenzar ahorita. Let me see. Uh, por aquí me están tirando mensajes en el grupo. Give me a second. Ok. Enterado. Ya me recibí el mensaje. Aquí está comunicándose conmigo Elizabeth. Muy bien. Now let's start. Vamos a comenzar. Yeah. Let's begin, right? And today we're going to start with the manual, with the manual, right? Listen, yesterday we were talking about your workplace, right? Su lugar de trabajo and your occupation. So today we continue. Here we have some occupations. Look, this is page number nine, right? Para los que tienen el manual, esta es la página número nueve. Page number nine, right? In this, we have uh, some occupations. Let me see. I'm going to move this a little bit. Okay. Permítame que algo me pasó aquí. Let's see. Vamos a compartir. Yes, por ahí estamos. Uh, minor. Okay. Copiado, minor, copiado. La esperamos. Ojalá que llegue a tiempo. Okay, good. Uh, then we have these occupations. Look, maintenance supervisor, engineer, floor manager, truck driver, secretary, right? Okay, now please repeat after me. Maintenance. Permítame, voy a, por ahí escucho un micrófono, así que vamos a hacer un movimiento por acá. Ok, good. Now, repeat after me, please. Repeat after me. Maintenance. Floor manager. Floor manager. Supervisor. Supervisor. Truck driver. Truck driver, engineer, secretary, secretary. Okay, good. Eh, JC, no he pasado lista todavía. Aquí estamos todavía. Tranquilo, ya lo voy a pasar. Y Alessandro, pues, vamos a estar ahí pendiente de la clase. Alessandro, no se preocupe. Well, I'll put it there. Okay. Good. Now, in the exercise, we're going to change uh, these words into the occupation we have here, right? These occupations here. Okay. Now, let's start with number one, please. Volunteers, number one. I will copy for Engineer. you. Right? I will copy for you. And this is the one, right? Okay, volunteer, raise your hands. Arriba las manitas. Participation. Come on. Hands. Hands up. Very good. Yvonne, please. What is number one, Yvonne? Engineer. Engineer. Very good. Excellent also, right? Now, number two. Rolov Gramen. 
programming, I don't know what is that. What is that? Floor manager. Huh? Floor manager. Okie dokie. Floor manager. Nice. Okay, let's go to number three. The car save. The car save. Okay. Uh, what is number three, class? One volunteer, raise your hands. Manita arriba. Participation, please. I need your secretary. Sorry? Secretary. Secretary. Okie dokie. Secretary. Excellent also, right? Let me see. Um, quiero ver el volumen. Realemos un segundito acá que... Um, casi no les copio. Realen un segundito acá. Uh, ahí estamos con el volumen. Claro, 40 lo teníamos. Ahí estamos ya. Ok. Estamos con todos los poderes ya. Yes. Sigamos. Ok. Ah, oh, sorry. Se me desconfiguró. Ahí está. Minor, please. Ya está Minor en su casa. Excelente, Minor. Buenas noches. Eh, no, no estoy en mi casa. De hecho, me acabo de bajar del transporte público y caminando. Ah, ok. Excelente. Thank you. Gracias por estar pendiente, Minor. Thank you very much. Good student. Good student. Thank you. Now. Number four, please, volunteers. Number four. Truck driver. Truck driver. Okay, nice. Then let's go to number number five, right? Se nota que han hecho la tarea. You did your homework. Nice. Supervise. Sup, sup, Superman? No, no. No, no. Super. Supervisor. Creo que era. Supervisor. <laughs> no me acuerdo. <laughs> supervisor, right? Super, supervisor. Okay. supervisor. I thought you'd say super. So, no. <laughs> okay. I say the Avengers. <laughs> okay. Then the last one. Number six. Volunteers, please. Maintenance. Sorry? Maintenance. Maintenance, right? Main. Maintenance. Maintenance. Let me see. Vamos a ver si no me he equivocado aquí. Ajá. Uh -huh. Yes, there is a mistake. This is an, an E, right? Teacher. Tell me. Uh, what is the maintenance means? Uh, mantenimiento. Uh... Maintenance. Okay, give me a second. Aquí nos equivocamos. Maintenance. Maintenance. Good. Veamos ahora si estamos en lo correcto. No, ya me equivoqué otra vez. Déjame un segundito. Okay. <laughs> Again, right? Give me a second. Estamos jugando aquí. Okay. Y vamos a escribirlo arriba. Ya les dije que me cuesta la, la tecnología. Mine, maintenance. Oh, see. Okay, engineer, floor manager, secretary, truck driver, supervisor, and maintenance. Maintenance, right? Good. Now let's continue. Vamos a seguir. Solo voy a tomar la lista ahorita. Okay, aha, uh -huh. questions. Tengo dos participantes. Preguntas. Teacher, este, ¿en, qué, ¿en qué página está? A page number nine. Page number nine. Here, right? La, la que quedamos debiendo ayer. Este es de la clase de ayer. Ok, ok. Page number nine, right? 
¿Alguien más me levantó la mano? ¿Anybody else? ¿Alguien más? No, no questions. Ok, continue, right? So let's go to the attendance. Vamos a ir a la asistencia. Ok. Um, let me see. Uh, my pen. Se me olvidó mi lapicero, permita. Tengo un ayudante ahora, me va a ayudar a alguien, permita. Ah, gracias. Ok, now, eh, Alessandro me manda ahí el mensaje, Alessandro, para la asistencia. Yes, thank you. Eh, Yvonne. Present. Débora. Here, teacher. Good, directly to Metapan, right, Débora? Good. Of Delia. Course. Of course. Present, teacher. Ok, thank you. Edwin. Present, teacher. Good. Lupita. Vamos a ver. Eh, ok, sigue teniendo problemas con el micrófono, entiendo, Lupita. Bueno, vamos a seguir comunicando entonces. Yes, oh, oh, sorry. Muy bien, entonces nos vamos a dar duro ahí con el, con el chat nada más, ok. Thank you, ya le puse presente. Erika. Ok, le me hiciste otro mensaje por acá. Ok, good. Eh, Erika. No yet. Abby. Abigail. Por ahí vi Abigail. A inicio de la clase. Abigail. No, bueno. Elizabeth viene en camino. Ok. Eh, Jonathan. Present teacher. Ok. Directo. Lourdes, dólar. Lourdes, dólar. <ríe> ok. Eh, José. Present teacher. Good. Naum. Present teacher. JC. Present teacher. Minor. Present. ¿Ya, ya llegó a la casita? Sí. No, no. Uy, Uy a comprar la cena. Tranquilo, si, si no es muy oscura y no va a tropezar, minor. Ok, Melba. Melba. Ok, good. Good. Mónica. Present. Good. Nicole. Present. Ok. Llegó a tiempo, Nicole. Congratulations. Oscar. Oscar. Present teacher. Good. Hello. Roberto. Roberto, no está Roberto, ok, eh, Jared, she's coming teacher, she's okay. eating, ok, good, no problem, no problem, mm -hmm. aquí le pusimos asistencia, okay. Emerson Alexis, Emerson Alexis, ok, Good. ¿Alguien que no haya mencionado? No, ok. Let's, be, let's continue, right? Entonces sigamos, sigamos. Let's continue, right? Now, page number 10, right? Yesterday we were learning about the verb to be. Affirmative and negative, right? For example, we say, I am Natalie. No, but I am not Natalie. I am the teacher, but this is the example, right? And in contraction, I'm Natalie. I'm not Natalie. I am not Natalie. Oh, I'm not Natalie, right? So this is negative and this is affirmative. And remember, we can make contractions. Look, I am, I'm. You are, your. He is, his. She is, she's. Good evening. Hey, good evening. Uh, Who is it? ¿Quién me está llamando? <ríe> eh, Roberto. Roberto, ¿verdad? Vale, Roberto, ya le pusimos asistencia, Roberto. Yes. Okay, Robert. 
Eh, ¿Alguien más? Emerson. Erika, Abigail. No, ok, continue, continue. So now we're going to complete the sentences using this, this form, right? Complete the following sentence, use the correct form of the verb to be and the occupations, right? Truck driver, number one, right? Assembler, number two. Number three is floor manager. And number four, maintenance. Number five, floor manager. And number six, engineer, right? So let's just start. Let's just start with Alan, right? And then I will ask my own volunteers. Uh, Yvonne, please. Let's just start with number one, Yvonne. Alan is, Alan R or Alan? Alan is. Alan is. Alan Brito, right? Alan is? A truck driver. A truck driver. El nombre completo de Alan is Alan Brito Delgado. Okay. Alan is a truck driver. Thank you. Next one, please. Deborah. Yes. Number two, assembler. Ensembler. I am assembler. I am a o an. An assembler. An assembler. Very good. Assembler. Nice. Number three, please. Delia, help me, please. With number three. Yes. Michelle. Me Michelle is a floor manager. He's a floor manager. Nice. Okay, let's, let's get the approval of Dudley. Vamos a ver si Dudley lo, lo aprueba. Aprobado. Yes. Good. Number four. My boss, negative in this case, right? My boss. Edwin, help me, Edwin. My boss uh, my, aren't or my boss isn't? My, my boss isn't. My boss isn't. Ah, uh, maintenance, uh, right? Uh, my, uh -huh. maintenance. maintenance. Maintenance, right? The pronunciation mm -hmm. maintenance. Maintenance like curtain, cortina, mm -hmm. right? Curtain or like mountain. Maintenance. Maintenance. Okay. Good. Este es fácil de escribirlo. Yo me compliqué aquí, pero miren. La última palabra es nance. <laughs> nance. Maintenance, right? Okay. Good. Now, eh, Erika, ya vino, Erika. Abigail? No, Elisa, please. Erika. Erika, hello, Erika. Welcome. Ya le voy a poner, hello, poner asistencia, Erika, permítame. Ahí estamos, ¿ya? Erika? So, we are practicing with verb to be, is, are, and am, right? In this case, number five, he is, he are, or he am, Erika? Can you see? Alcanza a ver o está muy abajo. No logro ver la pantalla. No logro ver. Voy a moverlo. Se me va a desconfigurar un poquito, pero lo vamos a mover. Permítame. Upsi, lo moví mucho. Me fui demasiado, ¿verdad? Permítame. Permítame, Erika. Uh... Ahí sería, hasta ahí puedo moverlo, ¿sí? Dice, he, he, no floor manager, dice. Pero permita, para, para borrar lo anterior, voy a, voy a repasar, voy a repasar. Permita, aquí, aquí. Perdonen que esto es como estar en una estación espacial <ríe> tratando de arreglar. Ok, dice. Solo voy a leer la, hasta la 4 y después voy a hacer con Erika con la 5, ¿ok? Alan is a truck driver. I am 
and a zambler. Remember, when we use vowel, we say an a zambler. When we use a consonant like in truck, so we say a truck, right? And then number three, Michelle is a, a floor manager, floor manager. And number five, my boss isn't, my boss isn't a maintenance. My boss isn't a maintenance, right? Okay, vamos a borrar acá para que pueda ver Erika bien. Y vamos a agrandar también, ¿sí? Permítame, solo, solo bajo este por aquí. Y bajo este por acá. Van a disculpar que a veces me trago un poquito aquí. Ok, lo vamos a hacer más grande y ahí estamos. Ok, Erika, hoy sí, miren, ahí se ve bien, ¿ve? Ok, he isn't or he aren't a floor manager, Erika. He isn't or he aren't. Le vamos a ayudar un poquito aquí, le vamos a adelantar. He. No, no, veo. ¿No alcanza a ver. No. No, no. Tengo problemas. La ah, vaya, entonces la pantalla es, eh, déjeme ver, déjeme ver, vamos a hacer una cosa aquí, vamos a dejar de compartir, ahora compartimos, y le vamos a dar bien grandote, vamos a ver si así, más o menos alcanza a ver, Erika, no me preocupe, déjeme ver, he is, es, he is. Ay, ah, ya, no, ya no estaba bien, Uy, sí, ya. Sí. Va, pero este es negativo, Erika. Ajá, no había. Hisen, entonces, Hisen. ok. Pero regálame un segundito. Lo voy, a, manager. voy a escribir por acá, permítame. Ok. Hoy sí va a parecer más pequeño. He isn't a floor manager. Ya ve que sí se puede, sí se puede, yes. He is in a floor manager, right? Ok. Lo voy a borrar porque voy a pasar al otro, ¿sí? Very good. Ok, ahora lo hacemos más pequeño. Vamos a ver si me ayuda alguien más. Ok, thank you, thank you, Erika. Eh, Elizabeth. Buenas noches. Good, good night. Evening. Good evening. Good evening. Ah, good, evening. good evening. Welcome. Welcome, <laughs> Elizabeth. Okay, we're practicing with the verb to be, Elizabeth. So I need Tina. you to tell me, Tina? Number six. Number six, yes, please. Tina, Tina is an engineer. Tina is an engineer, right? Nice. Very good. So notice it's an. an engineer because an. engineer start with E. That is a vowel, right? Mm, okay. okay. Good. So now we're going to make an exercise. Vamos a hacer un ejercicio bien bonito. Les va a gustar. Uh, let me see. Lo vamos a hacer más pequeño aquí. Okay. Your turn. Complete the following information about three different people and write extra information, right? Using the negative, using the negative, right? Okay, good. Vamos a mover esto por acá un poquito para que me lo puedan ver. Por ahí. Si no, no sé cómo hacer. Ah, creo que por aquí vamos a hacerlo. Man. Ahí estamos. Excelentoso. Good. Now, uh, you're going to say your name and you're going to say what do you do and something that you don't do, right? Example. Okay. Uh, my name is Javier. I am a teacher. I am not an engineer. Okay. My name is Javier Gómez. 
I am a teacher. I am not an engineer. Okay. Good. Another example. Vamos a ver otro ejemplo. Le dije que ahora tengo un ayudante, así que permítame. Él me va a ayudar aquí. Permítame. Hello, my name is Dudley. I am a dinosaur. I am not a dog. Thank you, thank you. Okay, ahí estaba Dudley, ¿verdad? Affirmative and negative, right? So we're going to start with uh, Jonathan, please. Jonathan. Hoy no vamos a escribir porque... Me cuesta mucho estar escribiendo. Perdemos mucho tiempo. Lo vamos a ir a hacer de unos horas, ¿ok? So, please, Jonathan. Uh, ok. Uh, my name is Jonathan. Um, ahí la ocupación, ¿verdad? La mía. Yes. Uh, no sé. I am not... I am not a, a, a doctor, I am not a, a teacher, I am not a, um, a flight attendant, I am not a musician, singer, uh, engineer, etc., etc., right? Right. I am not. Uh, I am not a teacher. A teacher. Uh -huh. Okay. So again... My name is, repeat please, my name is. My name is. Jonathan. Jonathan, Jonathan. I am. I am. Oh. Yeah, segundo, ¿verdad? No, 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 it's the same. Es que solo para que lo diga de un solo, para que lo diga de corrido. Ajá. Uh -huh. My name is Jonathan, I am this. Uh -huh. My name is Jonathan. Uh, I not. Um, Primero, dígame su ocupación. Uh -huh. I am. Uh, I am uh, operador de montacargas. Ah, okay. Sí. Uh, is like, uh, like, forklift. Like, forklift. Forklift. Driver. Forklift. Fork, forklift. 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 Driver. Cliff. Fork es tenedor, ¿verdad? Fork. fork. Entonces, recuerde que el montacarga es como un tenedor, ¿no? Entonces, fork. Y fork. Leaf, leaf es levantar. Entonces, fork, fork leaf. leaf. Fork, fork leaf. leaf driver. Ok, ah, good. Okay. So, Jonathan is a fork leaf driver. Okay. And... My name is Jonathan. Uh, I am fork leaf driver. Uh, I, I'm not... Um, Doctor. Good. Thank you. Thank you. Now, he is, Jonathan, he is a forklift driver. He is not a doctor. Okay. I will read about Lupita, right? Uh, her name is Lupita. Her occupation is auditor. Auditor. She is an auditor, right? She is not a doctor. Okay. Now, uh, Jose, please. Your turn, Jose. Jose. Mm. My name is Jose. I am a driver. I am not a doctor. Okay, nice. Thank you, Jose. Thank you very much. Now, uh, I am Naum. Uh, I am a floor manager. I am I am a not manager. Manager. Okay, so. I mean, when you say manager is that eh, es el jefe es el jefe del, del jefe de piso, ¿verdad? Yes. yes. Ah, okay. Yes. Sí, hay, hay un jefe de jefes. <laughs> okay. I understand now. I understand. Nice. Nice. Now, JC, please. My name is Juan Carlos. 
Uh, I am accountant. And and I I am I am am accountant. An accountant. I am I am not a doctor. Okay. Ya me están desgastando doctor, así que vamos a vamos a dar otro. A teacher, a florist, firefighter, es bombero, firefighter, secretary. Uh, receptionist, waiter, uh, mason, que es al, el albañil, right? Mason, uh, are many, many occupations. Nurse, nurse too. Now, thank you, JC, thank you very much. Minor, Teacher. please, yes? Contador, eh, ¿cómo se pronuncia correctamente? Accountant. Gracias. Accountant. Accountant. Okay, good. Now, um, Minor, please. Hi, uh, my name is Minor. Uh, my occupation is auxiliary accountant. Oh. I am not architect. Nice, easy and fast, right? Thank you very much, Minor. Melba, please. My name is Melba Cabrera. I am a supervisor. Mm -hmm. I'm not engineer. You're not an engineer, right? Thank you, Melba. Thank you very much. Monica, please. Mm, my name is Monica Cañada. Uh, I am sale, no, sale person. Uh -huh. uh, I'm not a teacher. Oh, there. yes. Nice. Thank you very much. Nicole. I am not a teacher. You're not a teacher, yes. Okay. De la que se salvó. <laughs> okay. Good. Nicole. Uh, my name is Nicole Castaneda. I am the cashier. I'm not the manager. You're not my. You, sorry, Nicole, you're a teacher? I am cashier. No, I don't get it. No, 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 le, no le capto, perdón. Eh, en español, dígame lo que... Cajera. Ah, cashier. Ok. You're a cashier. Nice. So you, you manage money, right? Maneja el, el cash. Nice. Ok. Thank you, Nicole. Thank you very much. Now, Oscar, please. My name is Oscar Bonilla. My occupation sales consult. Oh, it's sales consult. I guess it's consultant, right? Oscar, creo yes. que la palabra es consultant. Consultor de, de venta sería, ¿verdad? Yes. Oh, good. Excellent. Continue, continue, Oscar. I'm not architect. You're not an architect. Good. Thank you. Thank you very much. Roberto, please. Hello. Hello, Roberto. Okay, please. My name is Robert. Uh -huh. I accountant. An accountant? I'm not nurse. You're not a nurse. <laughs> Por, ahí, Por ahí está la princesa, va Jonathan. <laughs> Le vamos a mandar un saludo a Jonathan. A la princesa de Jonathan, aquí lo están saludando. ¿eh? Ok. Good. Eh, then, Jaris, please. Jari. My name is Jari. My occupation, Flores. I am no secretary. You're a florist? Nice. Very good. Excelentoso. Good. Now, uh, Alessandro, si gusta, me manda la presentación ahí en el, en el chat. ¿Qué es lo que hace? ¿Verdad? Y vamos, ¿qué me faltó? Yvonne, Débora y Delia, creo, nada más, ¿verdad? Vamos a ver. Yvonne, please. My, my name is Yvonne Calderón. Uh, occupation, I am 
an engineer. Uh, I am not an astronaut. You're not an astronaut. Engineer, Ivonne. Nice. Yes. Excelentoso. Right. Good. Deborah, please. Hi, everyone. My name is Deborah. Um, I am an accountant ah, and okay. I am not a chef, but I cook pretty good. Oh, oh my goodness. Congratulations. Deborah, what is your specialty? What's your specialty? Your my, specialty. My hmm? I, I, I can hear it pretty well. Can you repeat it? Uh, what's your specialty? What is your best dish? Oh, I could um, apple pie. Oh. And also I, I could uh, a lasagna. Lasagna, my goodness, yeah. delicious. <laughs> An apple pie. Mm -hmm. Very good. We have coffee. Nice. Right. Thank you. Thank you very much. Delia, please. Um, my name is Delia. I am a store manager. I am not a community manager. So you're a manager, Delia. Excuse me. Yes. Yes, teacher. <laughs> yeah. I am the boss. No. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Very good. Thank you, everybody. Now, this is your occupation, right? Now, teacher, tell me. Listen. Tell me. That's it, teacher. Yeah, yeah I can hear you. But... <laughs> ah, the fast. That's it. Fast is winning. <laughs> Está ganando el fast. Yes. <laughs> ah, okay, very good. So, they have a good team, right? A ver si logran ganar una corona más porque les ha costado estos años, ¿verdad? Okay. Now, let's continue with this conversation. Look. Page number 11, right? Page 11. Eh, aquí está, permítame, aquí está Alessandro, permítame. Voy a terminar con Alessandro. Regálenme un segundito. Entonces, regreso acá. Ok, his name is Alessandro. He is an assistant low. Um, sería como... No, no entiendo bien. Eh, Si me lo manda en español, Alessandro, assistant load. Bueno, y he is not a doctor. He is not a doctor. Solo entiendo que es un asistente, assistant. Pero si no, no, no entiendo de, de carga sería. O de despacho de mercadería quizás. No, no. no. Asistente de carga. Ah, ok. Sí, así se dice, es cierto. Assistant load. Estaba en lo correcto, Alessandro. Ok. Assistant load. Nice. Very good. Thank you, Alessandro. Now, let's go to the conversation. Look. If we have a, a person, right, coming to a new company, uh, she is a secretary, right? This is the occupation, secretary. And uh, she's introducing with some, with some co-workers. She's new in the company, right? The names are Romeo, Romeo, and Rodrigo, similar to, okay, uh, to some uh, co-workers, they are co-workers, sorry. Okay. Then it says, Mari, good morning. I am Ms. Mari Garcia. I'm the new secretary. Nice to meet you. And Romeo says, nice to meet you too. I am Mr. Romeo Lobos. Arr! And they are Mr. Rodrigo Campos and Mr. Luis Perez. And Rodrigo said, welcome. We are from the marketing department. And Romeo said, no, I am not. No, yo no soy de departamento, dice Romeo. I am from the quality department. They are marketing managers. Ellos son los que trabajan en el marketing, no yo, dice Romeo. And Rodrigo says, yes, we are in from the same department. No somos del mismo departamento de trabajo. But we are colleagues, colleagues. And Marie says, thank you so much for the information, right? Thank you so much for the information. Cuando llegamos a trabajo, pues, llegamos como pollitos comprados, ¿verdad? Se le toca a Mari. Y pues ahí están los compañeros presentándose. Siempre uno agradece que le den la bienvenida, ¿verdad? Okay, please repeat after me. Repeat after me. Good morning. 
I am Ms. Mari Garcia. I'm the new secretary. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. I am Mr. Romeo Lobos. And they are Mr. Rodrigo Campos and Mr. Luis Perez. Welcome. We are from the marketing department. Marketing department. No, I am not. I am from the quality department. Quality department. They are marketing managers. Marketing managers. Yes, we aren't from the same department. We aren't from the same department, but we are colleagues, 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 but we are colleagues. Thank you so much for the information. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much for the information. Okay, now please don't say thank you. Thank you, no. Mm -mm. Thank you, no. Thank you. Tha. Tha, 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 po. <laughs> thank you. Okay, very good. Now I need two volunteers. Let me see. Jari, please. Uh, you and Roberto. And Jari, Roberto, and Oscar, right? So, Jari, you're going to be Mari. Uh, Roberto, you're going to be Romeo, and Oscar, you're going to be uh, Rodrigo, right? Understand? Okay. Yes. One, two, three, action. Jari. Hello, hello. Bueno, entonces me voy a ayudar Nicole. Please, Nicole, help me. You're going to be uh, Mari, please. Ready? Okay. One, two, three. Action. Good morning. I am Mr. Maria Garcia. and the new secretary. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. I am Mr. Romeo Lobos. And dry Mr. Rodrigo Campos and Mr. Luis Perez. Well, welcome. We are from the marketing department. No, I am not. I am from the quality department. They are marketing managers. Uh -huh. Rodrigo. Rodrigo. <laughs> <laughs> Rodrigo is Oscar, right? Oscar? Yes. Yes. We are. I from. They. Some. Department. Would wear it. Colleagues, colleagues. Okay, good. Finish. Nicole? Thank you so much for the information. Okay, very good. Now, minor, any question, minor? No, no. No, no question. Es que vi que levantó la manita ahí. Teacher, I had a question. Okay, How do please. you pronounce? Quality or quality? Both are correct. Oh, uh, okay. Quality and quality. 
Uh, similar to elevator, elevator. For example, okay, water, water, 2020. Mm, both pronouncing, especially ya, in, in. Ya puedo. Uh -huh. Yes, of course. <laughs> okay. And, and uh, for example, you, you, I don't know if you remember Harry Potter, right? Harry Potter, you know, they, they speak something like, let's go to the party and let's take the elevator to the party, okay? Yeah. So they, they speak like this, you know, in, in, in England. So they pronounce more the T than the, but in United States, they say, they don't say ele, elevator, they say elevator, right? The same happened with quality or quality, quality, right? Okay, now let's continue. Uh, I need uh, more, uh, one more example of the practice, but we're going to, to practice the pronunciation. So again, but this time more fluent, right? Repeat after me, please. Good morning. I am Ms. Mari Garcia. I'm, I'm the new secretary. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. I am Mr. Romeo Lobos. And they are Mr. Rodrigo Campos and Mr. Luis Perez. Welcome. We are from the marketing department. No, I'm not. I am from the quality department. They are marketing managers. Yes, we aren't from the same department. But we are colleagues. Thank you so much for the information. Okay, good. Now, please, Monica, you're going to be Mari. Minor, you're going to be Romeo. Romeo, Romeo, donde estas que no te veo? And um, Jace, let me see. Minor, Romeo, right? And JC, you're going to be Rodrigo. Okay, understand? So one, two, three, action. Good morning. I am Mr. Mari. Mari Garcia. I am the new secretary. Nice to meet you. Uh -huh, minor. <laughs> no hay problema, minor. No se preocupe. Vamos. Nice to meet you too. I am Mr. Romeo Lobos, and they are Mr. Rodrigo Campos and Mr. Luis Perez. Welcome. We are from the marketing department. No, I'm not. I am from the quality department. They are marketing managers. Yes, we are from the same department, but we are colleagues. Thank you so much for the information. Okay, very good. Very good. Eh, tranquilo, Maino, que a veces a mí, hasta el perrito viene a veces a interrumpirme. <laughs> Me viene a saludar y o a veces se oyen hasta los vecinos. Así que no hay problema. No se preocupen. Siempre hay interrupciones, ¿verdad? Ok. Congratulations to everybody. Good. Now we're going to continue and let's say. Complete the sentences using some information from the conversation, right? Para ahorrarnos tiempo lo vamos a hacer rápido. Rodrigo and Luis are or aren't marketing managers. What do you think? Rodrigo and Luis are or aren't? This question is for Melba, please. What do you think, Melba? Affirmative or negative? Number one. Affirmative. Affirmative, right? So please read. Rodrigo, Rodrigo and Luis are marketing managers. Okie dokie. 
Look, marketing managers. They are marketing managers, okay? Mm -hmm. Thank you. Eh, Luis no participa en la conversación. No sé cuál de estos es ahí el dibujito, pero ellos son marketing managers. Okay. Number two. Eh, let me see. Naum, please. Romeo, Romeo, right? Romeo, where are you that I don't see you? Romeo and Rodrigo are or aren't from the same department? Aren't. Aren't. Very good. They are not from the same department. No trabajan en el mismo departamento, ¿verdad? Yes. Good. And number three. No, uh, number two, number three. Number three. Eh, eh, Jose, please. Jose. We are uh, colleagues or we aren't colleagues? We aren't colleagues. Huh? We are in colleagues? Wait a minute. Look. We are colleagues. Okay, very good. We are colleagues. Correction, right? Corrigiendo en el camino. So we are colleagues. Thank you. Number four. Um, let me see. Jonathan, please. Number four. They are or they aren't? They, they are. They are, correct. They are. This is for everybody, congratulations. So, Rodrigo and Luis are marketing managers. Romeo and Rodrigo aren't from the same department. We are colleagues and they are in the same company. Trabajan en la misma compañía, the same, la misma compañía, right? The same company. Good? That's it, right? Now let's continue with plural, right? Here, it's singular. Aquí tenemos los, los uh, sujetos singulares, ¿no? Primera persona, segunda persona y tercera persona singular, yes? La primera persona es la que habla, I, right? Yo, you, tú, tú eres el que escucha, segunda persona, y de quién hablamos? De quién es el chamber, right? Es la tercera persona. He, de él. O de ella, right? Como el ejemplo que vimos, digamos, este. Um, I am a teacher. Jonathan is a forklift driver, right? Okay. Uh, I am a teacher. Uh, JC is an accountant, right? So I'm talking about me, y luego que hablo de otra tercera persona, hablo de él o ella, right? But they are singular, todos son singulares. Pero ahora vamos a ver the plural. Look, we are Irene and Cindy. Contraction, we're. We are not Irene and Cindy, in, in negative, right? You are managers. Aquí el you, veamos ahí, ¿verdad? Que significa ustedes. ¿Por qué sabemos que es ustedes? Porque aquí dice managers. En plural, ¿no? Entonces, el you significa tú, vos o usted, y en plural significa ustedes, ¿ok? Good. Y tercera persona, plural, en este caso es they, ellos. So, we, nosotros, primera persona, ustedes, segunda persona, y ellos. ¿De quién es el chambre, verdad? No sé si alguno de ustedes va a la tienda o a la tortillería, pues ahí. Se conocen todas las noticias de la colonia, ¿verdad? Y hablan de terceras personas. <laughs> ¿Ok? Good. So, eso es la tercera persona plural, ¿sí? Ok, now we're going to make similar, right? With the verb to be in affirmative and negative, right? Here in this case, uh, Elizabeth, please. Can you help me with number one, Elizabeth? They, they are receptionists. They are receptionists. Good. They are receptionists. Thank you, Elizabeth. And number two, Abigail. You are not super, supervisor. Supervisors. Supervisor. Supervisor, you know? You are not super. Este, no sé, los supervisores siempre andan 
observando, revisando y todo, ¿verdad? Supervisor. So you are not supervisor. In plural, ustedes no son, ¿verdad? Right? Eh, hablando de observaciones, eh, no sé si hay mucho atrevimiento, pero podría hacerle una observación. No se enojan si le hago una observación. ¿Está bien? Va, permítame ahorita. Ok. Ya hicimos la observación. Ok. Sigamos. Number three. Number three, please. Eh, help me, Erika, please. Susana y Marcos. Erika. Ok. Vamos a pedirle a Lupita vía vía chat, que nos responda. ¿Verdad, Lupita? Y mientras tanto me voy a ir a la número cuatro con Edwin, please. Edwin, number four. We, we are account. Accountant. Very good. Notice that Edwin didn't use A, right? Se, se dieron cuenta que Edwin no usó A. ¿Por qué no usó A? Porque accountants es plural. ¿Sí? No, no vamos a decir en, nosotros somos un contadores. Eh, no, nosotros somos contadores, right? Thank you, Edwin. Thank you very much. Eh, then, Delia, ah, por aquí está el de Lupita. Antes de ir con Delia, vamos a ver qué dice Lupita. Ok. Susana y Marcos are not colleagues. Very good. Thank you. Susana y Marcos are not colleagues. Thank you, Lupita. Oh, you can say. Susana y Marcos eh, aren't colleagues, right? Good. Number five, please. Eh, Delia, help me, please, with number five. We are Carla and Sandra. Nice. Deborah, please, number six. Okay. They are Miss Herrera and Miss Mejia. Miss Herrera and Miss Mejia. Okay. When I say Miss, The woman could be married or no married, right? Miss, married or no married. But when I say Mrs., Mrs. is married, right? Mrs. Okay. In the case of men, we can say Mr., for example, Mr. Edwin Escobar, right? Mr. Edwin Escobar, right? Any single. Puede ser soltero o puede ser... Game over. <laughs> Casado, ¿verdad? Edwin, you're married, Edwin. Uh, o single. Casado. Casado. <laughs> Después Game de la over. clase a lavar los trastes. <laughs> Come on. Okay, good. Thank you, Edwin. So in this case for men, Mr. Edwin Herrera, Mer, uh, single, or Mr. Edwin Herrera, Mer, right? But for the women, we say Miss. Miss Herrera, Miss Mejía, puede ser que esté casada o no casada, ¿verdad? Y Miss, solo con ese, entonces soltera. Y por último, Mrs. es casada, ¿ok? Now, let's continue, please. Vamos a ver si terminamos acá. Ah, aquí es la, la otra lección. Entonces, terminamos la tarea que teníamos ayer. Aquí está, ¿ok? Para ahora, pues, vamos a eh, introducir lo que son las preguntas. Ya vimos las oraciones afirmativas, yeah. las negativas, y ahora vamos con las preguntas. Ladies and gentlemen, with the question. Pero antes, um, quisiera saber si todos accesaron a su plataforma. ¿Ya resolvieron la, la tarea 1? Yes. Yes, ok. Si alguien yes. tiene problemas, me avisa. Eh, me he fijado que en el grupo de WhatsApp eh, están los compañeros del área técnica ayudándole, ¿verdad? Ajá, Elisa, por ahí está con su bebé. Ah, ok. Es una princesa, que es preciosa. <ríe> Regale un segundo, aquí también la vamos a saludar, Elisa. Hello. Hola, hola. Hello, hello. Hello. Con la manita. Es mudita. Ah, 
¿Cuánto tiene ya? ¿Ya cumplió el año, Elizabeth? Sí, tiene ah. un año y, y cinco meses. Ah, bueno, pues ya corre por toda la casa, ¿verdad? Sí. <risa> ya me imagino, Elizabeth. Ok, good. Minor, ¿me va a decir algo, Minor? Eh, sí, tenía una duda. Sí, <coughs> ¿Hasta bien. qué hora es lo máximo que podremos realizar la tarea el día de mañana? Ya que comentó todo que todos los viernes las... Todo el día, hasta las 12 de la noche se cierra, así que tranquilo. Eh, miren, Maynor, usted puede adelantarse si quiere también. Es decir, va, digamos, estamos un miércoles, usted dice, no, no va a ser que el viernes no pueda. Puede adelantarse, ¿verdad? Eh, si ya se dio cuenta, la plataforma es bien amigable, ¿verdad? No siento yo, perdón, no quiero ser el teacher, pero yo siento que está bien fácil, ¿verdad? Solo ir apretando aquí. Solo hay un ejercicio, parece que hay que escribir que ahí no se le puede olvidar poner el punto y cuando usemos el apóstrofe, por favorcito, eh, bueno, en mi, en mi, yo tengo como tres computadoras y todas, todas a la par del cero aparece el apóstrofe. No me lo vayan a poner tilde, ¿sí? sino que es apóstrofe. La tilde es aquí y el apóstrofe es acá. ¿sí? Entonces, para que no les va a salir mal, porque hay un ejercicio donde hay que escribir con mayúscula punto final y el apóstrofe, ¿sí? No se les va a olvidar la hora de hacer ese ejercicio. Eh, ¿Alguien más que tenga alguna pregunta de la plataforma? ¿Quieren que les explique algún ejercicio o estamos bien? ¿Estamos bien? Ya saben cómo accesar, ¿verdad? Solo voy a darles una... Permítame, vamos a compartir aquí. Eh, ¿Se ve aquí la plataforma? Ivonne, ¿lo alcanza a ver? Sí, ah, ok, muy bien. Entonces aquí está la unidad 1, miren. La unidad 1. Entonces aquí vamos a estar trabajando, ¿sí? Y aquí está la tarea 1 y la tarea 2, que es la que... Se supone que ya debe estar terminada la tarea 1, ¿verdad? Esa es la, la que correspondería. Esta va a ser para esta noche o mañana en la mañana, si quieren hacer. Y esta para el viernes, de la tarea 3. Hay una donde se escribe. Aquí esta no, creo. Esta tampoco. La tercera tampoco. Bueno. Es que hay una donde se escribe. Esta tampoco. Esta tampoco. No, pues no hay problema. Solo es de ir poniendo el puntito ahí, ¿verdad? El, es en la unidad 1. Muy bien. Entonces, seguimos. Solo voy a tomar la asistencia y luego sigo con, con la presentación para esta noche. So, eh, Alessandro, ¿me manda el mensaje, Alessandro? Ivonne. I'm here. Débora. I'm here, teacher. Good. Delia. I'm here, teacher. Very good. Thank you. Edwin. Segundo 45 minutos. Edwin. Sí, sí. Ok, good. Eh, Lupita, mándeme el mensaje. Erika. Present. Abigail. Present. Good. Eh, el, Elizabeth. Present. Jonathan. Present. José. Present, teacher. Naum. Present, teacher. JC. Present, teacher. Minor. Minor. Present. Good. Melba. Melba. Mónica. Present. Nicole. Present. Oscar. Present. Roberto. I am here. Good. Nice. Hasta San José Guayabal. Ha de ser bien fresco, José San José. Yes. Guayabal. Sí, ¿verdad? Wonderful. Good, excellent. Yari. Present. Good. Emerson Alexis. Quizás no le han informado a Emerson que ya tiene clase, ¿verdad? Porque ayer tampoco no estuvo con nosotros. Eh, Melba. Melba. Present. Ah, ok, good. Excelentoso, Melba. No, let me see. Por aquí tenemos a Lupita. 
y Alessandro, que están pendientes, ¿verdad? No les funciona el micrófono, pero están con todos los poderes ahí. Ok, very good, tenemos casa llena. Lo felicito, hasta ahorita vamos como el reloj, ¿verdad? Al punto todo, lo felicito. Now, let's go to the PowerPoint presentation for tonight. Good. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to English for Word Pro, basic module one. Today is Thursday, September 22nd. And we're going to learn about yes, no question and short answer. Pregunta de sí, no, and short answer, right? And that's it, right? The expression. Vamos a repasar la, las expresiones. Ah, Melba. Por ahí está Melba. Ok. Muy bien. Um, these are expressions we can use in this class. Right? Estas expresiones las podemos usar en, en la clase. So, for example. Excuse me. Can you repeat that? Cuando no entiendan algo, pues, díganme. Teacher. Excuse me, teacher. Can you repeat that? Then, how do you spell? Um, Vamos a ver en esta unidad uno el alfabeto, the alphabet, right? Y vamos a aprender a deletrear. Entonces, cuando ustedes quieren que yo les deletree una palabra, how do you spell? For example, how do you spell language? It's L-A-N-G-U-A-G-E, language. How do you spell classroom? C-L-A-S-S-R-O-O-M, right? Classroom. Then another thing is, can you speak more slowly, teacher? Puedo hablar más lento, teacher. What does cat mean? What does dog mean? What does, um, I don't know, the oxyribonucleic acid mean, right? ¿Qué significa ácido de oxyribonucleico? <laughs> ¿Qué significa gato? ¿Qué significa puerta, etc., cetera, etc., cetera, right? Good. And then how do you pronounce? Si quieren... Saber cómo se pronuncia una palabra en inglés, me van a decir teacher. Oops, sorry. Perdón, ya me adelanté. How do you pronounce? Y la última, espero que la vean todos hasta bajito, está How do you say in English, right? For example, how do you say, ¿cómo se llama? Melba, ¿usted sabe cómo se llama ese invento que nos sirve para ver a través de las paredes? Window. Window. Excellent. Está en la jugada, Melba. Very good. So, how do you say window in Spanish? Ventana, right? Or the opposite. How do you say ventana in English, right? Okay? Very good. Van a perdonar a veces el humor de Chiclin, ¿verdad? Pero para, es para mantenernos despiertos, ¿sí? Mantener el humor ahí. <laughs> okay. Thank you. Now, the objective for tonight, please. Deborah, can you read the objective for tonight, please, for the class? Okay. Uh, unit one, get to know someone. And I will be able to ask other about their names and occupation in their workplaces. My goodness, good pronunciation, Deborah. I like, I like your pronunciation, nice. Está lista ya para ir a otro nivel, creo, intermedio ya de un solo. <laughs> Good, thank you, Deborah. Now, here is the way we make questions, class. Listen, how to use yes, no question and short answer with verb to be. For example, here we have the yes, no question. Look, are you Carlos? Notice that uh, in the affirmative sentence, you say, you are Carlos, right? But in questions, you change the position of the verb to be in the subject like this. Yes? You are Carlos for, are you Carlos? And then you say, yes, I am. Oh, if you're not Carlos, you say, no, I'm not. Notice that in affirmative short answers, we don't use contraction. For example, say, are, you, are you Carlos? Yes, I'm. <laughs> yes, I'm. And no, right? It's, yes, I am. It's full. No contraction, in affirmative, okay? Don't forget that. Then, 
Instead of say she is a manager, we say is she a manager? Yes, she is, or no, she isn't. Or you can say, no, she's not. Is he a supervisor? Yes, he is. No, he isn't. Or no, he's not. Are you colleagues? Notice the intonation, right? The intonation is rising intonation. So, are you colleagues? Exaggeration, listen. Are you colleagues? Are you colleagues? Yes, we are. No, we aren't. Oh, no, we're not. Then when you make the question with, are you colleagues? He says, son ustedes colegas? Then you have to say, right? Yes, we, or no, we, right? Why? Because the opposite of you is we. Yes? And the, in, in plural, right? And in singular, the opposite of you is I. Cuando ustedes les preguntan, eres tú? So ustedes van a decir, sí, yo soy. ¿Son ustedes? Sí, nosotros somos, okay? Are you colleagues? Yes, we are. Are you Carlos? Yes, I am. Good. And then, are they service providers? Yes, they are. No, they aren't. Oh, no, they're not. Are you bosses here? Yes, they are. No, they aren't. Oh, no, they're not. Good. Repeat after me, please. Repeat after me. Are you Carlos? Yes, I am. No, I'm not. I'm not. I'm incorrect. I'm. Yes, I'm. No, no, no. I'm. No, I'm not. Good. Is she a manager? Yes, she is. No, she isn't. No, she's not. Is he a supervisor? Yes, he is. No, he isn't. No, he's not. Are you colleagues? Yes, we are. No, we aren't. No, we're not. Are they service providers? Yes, they are. No, they aren't. No, they're not. Are your bosses here? Yes, they are. No, they aren't. No, they're not. Good, any question? Questions, questions, questions? You know what is service providers? Yvonne, please. What is service providers? How do you say service providers in Spanish, Yvonne? Um, no, no idea, no idea. No. Okay, Melba, please. How do you how do you say service providers in Spanish? I don't know. Tisha. You don't know, Melba. Oh, okay. Anybody knows? Proveedor de servicios. Okidoki. Yes, proveedor de servicios. Very good. That's it, right? And boss, you know, or this in this case is plural, right? Bosses. How do you say bosses in, in Spanish? Bosses. Jose? How do you say bosses? Jefes. Je oh, yes. Yes. Jefes. Jefes. <laughs> okay, very good. Me asustó, ¿verdad? Eh, cuando, cuando escuché la voz, porque dije <laughs> que se, se vio la diferen diferente la voz, dije. Uh -huh. Bosses, right? Jefes. Thank you very much. Thank you. This is for you. Thank you. Now, then this is the way we, we make yes, no question. Look, this is the format, right? Recuérdense que esta, esta, esta eh, PowerPoint se los envío esta noche para que ustedes lo practiquen en casa, ¿sí? Pero practiquenlo, ¿eh? Al menos leanlo ahí, ¿sí? So, yes, no question. Look, are you an architect? 
Yes, I am. No, I'm not. Is he an architect? Yes, he is. No, he's not. Is Tanya an architect? Yes, she is. No, she's not. Is um, Jonathan uh, 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 forklift driver? Yes, he is. Oh, no, he's not. Is JC a singer? Yes, he is. Right? Oh, no, no, he's not. And in plural, this is singular, right? Now, in plural, are you, son ustedes, right? Here, por aquí podríamos confundir, ¿no? Pero recuérdense que cuando el nombre está en singular, entonces, es, eres tú, right? Are you, right? Y si el nombre está en plural, el are you significa son ustedes, ¿sí? Are you musicians? Yes, we are. No, no, we're not. Are they musicians? Yes, they are. No, they're not. And then are Ted and Jane musicians? Yes, they are. No, they're not. Are Edwin and Jonathan accountants? Yes, they are. Voy a decir yes, porque aquí la mayoría son contadores, ¿verdad? <laughs> Lo felicito. Sean duro con los números, ¿sí? Are Naun and, and Delia um, doctors? Yes, they are. No, they're not. Right? Good. This is the general view, right? Now it's time to work. Ahora sí, trabajar todos, yes? Number one, it says complete the, the question, right? The answer is we, right? ¿Qué dijimos? Cuando la, la, la respuesta es we, la pregunta sería con you, right? ¿Sí? Entonces aquí por eso la pregunta. Are you musicians? Yes, we are. We're musicians, right? Good. Now, number two. Let me see who's going to help me. Vamos a agarrar al azar. Aquí a la garduña, a ver quién cae. <laughs> Let me see. And Erika, please, Miss Alvarado. The answer is, vea la respuesta, Erika. No, they're not teachers. They're scientists. ¿Cuál sería la pregunta entonces, Erika? Which is the question? R. R, uh-huh. Are they? Are they? Teacher. Are they teachers? Okie dokie, nice. Are they teachers? No, they're not teachers. They're scientists, right? Nice. Number three, please. Uh, again, please. The... Mm, Jari. Jari, please, number three. Yes, Anne is a doctor. Anne is a doctor. Mm -hmm. What would be the question, Jari? Okay, permítame, tengo un mensaje por acá. Uh, ok, no hay problema, Yari. No hay problema, yo entiendo. Solo siga la, la, la clase entonces, no, no, no tenga pena. Eh, Robert, please help me, Robert. Is. Is. Mm -hmm. Is. Is she a doctor? Is she a doctor? A doctor. Oops, <laughs> sorry. A doctor. A doctor. Is she a doctor? Or we can say, is Anne? Is Anne? También podemos usar el nombre ¿verdad? para ubicarnos. Uh, is Anne a doctor? Very good. Thank you very much. Thank you. Okay, you're welcome. Thank you. Good. Now, number four, please. Otra victim. Sorry, another student. <laughs> And Elizabeth. 
Come on, Elizabeth, number four. Mm -hmm. Helen. Helen is a woman, right? She is an Elizabeth. artist. Oh, I don't know. She is. <laughs> Help me. She is. She is. Look. Is she? Is she, is she correct? An architect. Uh, uh -huh. How do it's you pronounce? Architect. 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 Yes. Permítame, algo me pasa aquí que no, no. Ahí está. Is she? Is an she? Architect. An architect. Mm, architect. Architect. Good. Oh, is Helen right? Para poder identificarla en la pregunta. Is Helen? An architect. Okie dokie. Thank you. Number five, please. Um, sorry, I'm sorry. Uh, Jonathan. Jonathan. Come on, Jonathan. Yes, I'm a pilot, says, right? Yes, I'm a pilot. So, what is the question, Jonathan? Uh huh. I will help you. Listen, le vamos a ayudar, ¿sí? Please. Okay. Eh, le vamos a dar un comodín, Jonathan. ¿Qué quiere? La llamada al público o, o el 50-50? 50-50. ¿Cuál quiere? Eh, la llamada al público. La llamada al público. Bueno, permítanme. Sí, ¿alguien me dijo algo ahí? Ajá, Minor. Eh, yo tenía mi duda con la pregunta 4. Con la pregunta 4, vaya. Si gusta, vamos a terminar las cinco con, con Jonathan y después, no, después regresamos a las cuatro. Sí, permítanme. La llamada al público. Ivonne, hello. Eh, hello. Eh, aquí me está contestando Ivonne, Jonathan. Eh, eh, necesita ayuda ahí, Jonathan. Eh, ¿Cuál verbo vamos a usar aquí? ¿Is o are? Ivonne. Are. Are. Y luego... ¿Cuál es el sujeto, Ivón? Are you. Ah, ok, muy bien. Gracias. Bye, bye. Bye. Ok. Vaya, Jonathan, ya le ayudo al público. <risa> ¿Ya escuchó? Are, uh -huh. are. Are you. Are you. Um, mm. Ahí está la respuesta abajo. Are you. Uh, I am. No, no. Are you? Are you? Are you a doctor? Yes. Are you a doctor? Are you? Are you a, a teacher? Are you a pupusero? Are you a? Uh, mm -hmm. uh, are you? Abajo está la respuesta. Vamos. Yes. Are you? I'm doctor. No, 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 no. No, no. A abajo está. Por ahí está. Yes. Are you? Uh, pilot, pilot. A pilot. Very good. I pilot. Are I you pilot. a pilot? And then, yes, I'm a pilot. Very good. That's yes. it, right? Thank you. Thank you very much. Gracias al público por estar pendiente. <laughs> Ahora vamos a la cuatro. Number four. Uh, is Helen an architect? Que a ver si no me equivoco. Así, oh, ¿verdad? No, Helen is an architect. Ah, ya entendí lo que dice Minor, sí. No, Helen is an architect. She's not a writer. Sí, permítame. ¿Cómo es la cosa aquí? ¿Es Helen an architect? No, Helen is an architect. Sería la pregunta, ¿Is Helen a writer? Yes, Minor, thank you. Minor tiene vista de detective, ya lo vimos. Sería writer. ¿Is Helen a writer? Ya ven que no dejan perder al teacher ustedes, ¿verdad? Gracias. Gracias, Minor. Thank you very much. Is Helen a writer? No, Helen is an architect. She's not a writer, right? Ahí, hoy sí ya tiene lógica la pregunta, ¿sí? Thank you. Y por aquí tengo un mensaje. Ajá, Lupita, thank you. Are you a pilot? Yes, yes, I'm a pilot. Aquí sí podemos usar contracción porque está más... 
más larga la respuesta, ¿verdad? Ok, let's go to number six, please. Number six. Eh, the last big, the last student, I'm sorry. Melba. Ok, Melba. Number six, please. Eh, sería, are you pilots? Are you... Va, pero vamos a ver, no, no caigamos sí. en la número cuatro. Ah, aquí como Ajá, que... sí. Sería, are you flight attendants? Ah, ok, good. Ahí por ahí dice, are you flight are attendants? Are you flight attendants? Attendants, very good pronunciation, Melba. Are you okay. flight attendants? No, we're not flight attendants. We're pilots, yes. Okay, nice. We're going to practice, please. Eh, Yvonne and Débora, number one, please, question and answer. Solo déjeme proyectar lo más grande porque lo proyecto chiquito para que escribamos, ¿verdad? Pero aquí ya terminamos, pues pueden practicar. Ok, please, number one, question, Yvonne, answer Débora. Are you mus musician? Yes, we are. We are musicians. Thank you very much. Number two, please. Delia and Edwin. Number two. Are they teachers? Edwin? No, they, no, they are not teacher. They are as in scientists. Scientists. Okay, good. A doctor. No, 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 that's it. Hasta ahí, hasta ahí. Thank you. Hasta ahí. Uh, Thank you. Yeah. No, no, no. Good. Now, Erika and Abigail, please. Number three. Is Anne a doctor? Yes. Anne is a doctor. Very good. Number four, please. Uh, Sería Elizabeth, ¿verdad? Sí, Elizabeth and Jonathan. Number four, please. Question and answer. Elizabeth A and Jonathan B. Estoy perdida, fíjese. Ah, ok. Number uh, four. You, yes, number four. You're going to make letter A. Is Helen. Is Helen a uh, writer? Jonathan. No, 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 Helen is an architect. She's not right. right. Okay, thank you, thank you. Number five, please. Jose and Naum. Jose A, Naum B. Mr. Magaña? Sí. Uh, please, number five, your letter A, Jose, your letter A. Uh, are you a pilot? Yes, I'm a pilot. Very good. Pilot. Yes, a pilot. Thank you. Pilot. Number six, please. Uh, JC, a minor. JC, A, minor B. Are you fly attendant? No, we're not flight attendant. We are pilot. Good, good pronunciation, minor. Thank you. Good. Now, let's go to the next one, please. Here we're going to make question, right? This is a format, and then you're going to fix the the question according to the structure we we have already seen. De acuerdo a lo que hemos visto, pues vamos a ver cómo arreglar esto. For, for example, number one, singer Matt is a so, question, is Matt a singer? Is Matt a singer? Number two, please. Nos vamos a escapar acá para poder escribir. Yes. Uh, so, in this case, Melba, please. Can you help me, Melba, with number two? On Scrum, okay. that's my question. Uh -huh, please. Okay. Are you fly attendants? Are you, oops, are you fly? Are you fly? Attendance. Okie dokie. Are you flight attendants? 
Thank you. Now, Monica, number three. He is a chef. Okay, he is. Monica, look. He is. He is. Uh huh. He is. Yes. He does. <laughs> no. Okay. Is he is he a chef? Is he a chef? Like a question, listen. Is he a chef? Thank you, thank you very much. Nicole, please, number four. Are they bakers? Are they bakers or bankers? Bakers. Hmm? This is an end, right? Bankers. Bankers, bankers yes. Los bakers hacen pan, ¿verdad? Y los banqueros hacen, hacen robo. Um, perdón, sorry. <laughs> hacen, hacen dinero. <laughs> okay, are they bankers? Uh -huh, very good. And number five, please, uh, Oscar. Oscar, number five. I, they are. Ah, they are. No, look, Oscar. They are. And then. Are they? Are they correct? Are they? Kate and Laura. Kate and Laura. Over. Oops. Perdón, se me movió aquí la cosa. Oops. ¿Qué estoy haciendo? Permítame. Teacher. Sí. Será un, un segundito. Are they Kate and Laura? Over there, right? Por ahí. Por ahí, over there. Teacher. Ah, tell me. Uh, it's correct to say are they or only are K and Laura over there? Mm -hmm. That's what I'm going to say, right? Yes. Eso es lo que le iba a preguntar a Oscar. Yes. Oh. Okay, Oscar. Yes. So we have here, look, two from two subjects. Right? Bueno, tres en realidad. Entonces vamos a escoger uno, ¿le parece? O eliminamos K and Laura o eliminamos they. Well, yes. ¿Cuál le parece mejor que eliminemos? Kate. Kate. No, no, pero... Kate de la <ríe> me suena como el... Me suena como eliminar a Kate, ¿verdad? Qué feo soy yo. No, eh, vamos a eliminar Dave, ¿verdad? Sí, porque si se fija no está ahí arriba, ¿verdad? Ahora, sí se puede también decir, are they over there? Sí, sí se puede. Lo único que es que como cuando decimos que en Laura identificamos exactamente quiénes son, ¿verdad? Pero sí, are they over there está correcto. Solo que pues hay que escoger uno de los dos sujetos, ¿ok? Good, thank you very much, Oscar. Now, anybody else? Do you have questions? Questions? No questions? Good, we finish this, right? Now let's go to the menu. Ahora vamos al manual. Okay, here we are. Now to introduce, we have a conversation, right? But before to go to this, I have some question, right? Uh, I'm going to start with, um, let me see, Roberto, right? Robert. Robert, where do you work, Robert? What is the name of your company? Mejia Bahia Social. 
Okay, so, so you can say, I work in Mejia Valles y Asociados, right? I work in mm -hmm. Mejia Valle y Asociados. Good, thank you. Now, Rodrigo, okay. what do you do in Mejia Valle y Asociados? What is your function in the company? You are a, an accountant, you are a, an assistant, you are a manager. You are a, a lawyer, I don't know. I am a accountant. I am an accountant, okay, nice, nice, thank you. And Yvonne, please, where do you work, Yvonne? I am work in GVM in Salvador. Okay, and what do you do there? What do you do in the company? I work for a client of Costa Rica. So in this case, you are you are a salesperson? No. No. No, no, no. no. I didn't understand very well. Excuse me. I am um I am incident manager. Ah. Okay. I am a team for incident. I understand. I, I got it. Now I got it. So manager, to make it simple, right? Manager. And remember, managers have many functions. They, they supervise employees. They, they make reports. In your case, if there is a problem, is there an incident? So you, you go there. You, you're the one who... Yes. Uh, you are the firefighter, right? La Bombero, who make the solution for the problem, right? Yes. Okay, thank you. Thank you, Yvonne. Now, the last one, please. Uh, Deborah. Yes. Where do you work, Deborah? Uh, City Hall. Okay. And City Hall in San Salvador? No. Metapan? Yes. Metapan. Metapan City Hall. Okay. And what do you do exactly in, in the City Hall? Uh, I work as an auditor. An uh, auditor. Good. Nice. Mm -hmm. Like Lupita, Lupita is an auditor too, yes. It's my, my co-worker. Oh, really? Yes. Lupita is your co-worker, nice, I didn't know. Excellent, yes. Bueno, entonces esperamos que Lupita eh, consiga un micrófono. Yes, excellent. Uh, she's Capri. having many problems with, with her computer. Oh, uh -huh. yes, sorry, sorry for that. Listen, uh, last time, uh, I don't know, it's a suggestion, only a suggestion, right? Last time I, I went to a Metro Centro in Las Pulgas, right? <laughs> and I bought a, a headphones, you know, with microphone. It, it cost me $17, $17, so maybe it's a solution for Alessandro and Lupita, maybe it's a solution, maybe. I, I don't know, I mean, I'm not a technician, but <laughs> it's an option, yes? Uh, the the headphones and the microphone, right? Uh, I I have it over there. Uh, let me show you. Give me a second. These are the ones. Look. Yeah, but I don't use it in this in this computer because you can hear me, right? But look, seventeen dollars. Yeah, but she had a problem. With, with the, the computer. App. With the app. Ah, with the app. Uh -huh. okay, good. So I don't know. Sorry. Uh, I'm not very technician, but maybe. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe this day, right? Ojalá que estos días pueda resolver para que escuchemos la voz de Lupita y de, Ale y de Alessandro también, ¿verdad? <laughs> okay. Thank you, Deborah. Thank you very much. Por aquí está. Okay. Thank you, Lupita. Porque veo que está bien atenta también. La felicito. Okay, so Deborah is an she works in 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 the city hall of uh, Metapan, and she's an auditor, right? Okay, nice. Now let's go to the to the conversation. Okay, anytime, Lupita, anytime. And here we have Anna and Carlos. Listen, Anna says, "Hello, I'm Anna Trujillo." Hi, Anna. I'm Mr. Carlos Lopez. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Excuse me, is she Miss Diana Andrade? If you want to say in English, Diane, right, Diane? 
What we want to say, Diana? Diana Andrade? No, she isn't. She is Mrs. Diana Aguilar. She is the manager of the company. Okay. And are you the supervisor? No, I'm not. I am a salesperson. Thank you so much, Mr. Lopez. Good. Now, please repeat after me. Repeat after me. Hello. I'm Ana Trujillo. Hi, Ana. I'm Mr. Carlos Lopez. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Excuse me. Is she Miss Diana Andrade? No, she isn't. She is Mrs. Diana, I'm sorry, Mrs. Diana Aguilar. She's the manager of the company. Manager. Okay. And are you the supervisor? No, I'm, I am not. I am a salesperson. Thank you so much, Mr. Lopez. Thank you so much, Mr. Lopez. Okie dokie, now let's practice. Uh, let me see, what time is it? Yes, we have time, todavía tenemos tiempo, yes. So, uh, I need um, Yvonne and Deborah, please, yes. Practice the conversation. So Yvonne, you are Anna, and Deborah, you are Carlos, right? Hello, I am Ana Trujillo. Hi, Ana. I am Mr. Carlos Lopez. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Excuse me, is she Miss Diana Andrade? No, she isn't. She is Mr. Diana Aguilar. She is the manager of the company. Okay, and are you the supervisor? No, I am not. I am a salesperson. Thank you so much, Mr. Lopez. Good, thank you so much to you. So listen, this is Mrs., right? Mrs., 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 Mrs. De Diana Aguilar, right? And Teacher, is when Diana is a single or married? No, 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 when Diana Aguilar is married. Married, oh. Mrs. Diana Aguilar, it's, a, it's, it's married, right? It's like you say, la señora Diana Aguilar. Mrs. And when he is single? Uh, you can say Miss. And S dot or Miss S S. But the Ms. contraction? Oh, uh, yes. I mean, you can say Miss with S S, Miss. For, uh, sorry for the question. Are, are you married? No. No, no, no. So, so I can say Miss Vidal, right? Or Miss Deborah Vidal okay. with S S, Miss. And oh. I, I also can use the contraction. Ah, here, look, Miss. But the difference is, Miss is with S, Miss. And Only Ms, with one S. Uh, and this is with Z, Miss. Miss Diana Andrade, you know, Miss Deborah Vidal. And when you use Miss, uh, is when you don't know if the woman is married or not married. Uh, okay. So you, you can be married, Miss Diana Andrade, or single, Miss Diana Andrade, no problem. But if you say Miss with SS, Miss, you're Thanks. single, single, only single. Teacher. Give me a second, give me a second. And when you say Mrs., Mrs., in this case, only married, only married, right? Understand? Deborah? Yes. Oh, good. Thank you so much. No, 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 no problem. Okay. Anybody else? Alguien más me llamó por ahí? Delia. Yes, me. No, it's just in case because um, uh, Jose, I don't know if you see the the chat, uh -huh. but he said that he's going to drive. 
right now. Oh, yes, yeah, yes, no problem. Okay. Yes, thank mm -hmm. you, Lydia, thank you. Just in case, Steve. No, no, thank you, thank you very much. Nice. Uh, I have some, some eyes around me helping me. Thank you, thank you, Delia. Okay, good, no problem, Jose. I understand, you have to drive, eh? Uh, as we talked yesterday, right? You can you can pay attention to the class, but no participation, right? Ya sabemos que José pues va a estar ahí atento, pero no va a participar. Sí, no queremos que pase un accidente ahí en los chorros, ¿verdad? <ríe> que cada ratito hay accidentes por ahí. No, no, no. Tranquilo, ahí, José. Now, uh, then I need um, Delia. Can you help me? You and Edwin, please. Edwin, your Carlos, and Delia, your Anna, please. One, two, three. Hello, I am Anna Trujillo. Hi, Anna. I am Mr. I am Mr. Carlos Lopez. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Excuse me, is she Miss Diana Andrade? No, she is not. She is Mr. Diana Aguilar. She is the manager of the company. Okay, and are you the supervisor? No, I am not. I am a sad person. Thank you so much, Mr. Lopez. Okie dokie, thank you. And Edwin, don't forget that in this case, it's not Mr., right? No, it's Mrs. 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 De oh. Diana Aguilar. Mrs. Mrs., right? Okay. Mrs. And this is salesperson. Sales. Person. Thank you. Sales. Thank you. Okay. Sales. Sales. Now, thank you, Delias. Thank you, Edwin. And the last, the last participation. Let me see. Um, Erika and Abigail, right? Erika, uh, the role of Anna, and Abigail, the role of Carlos, please. Hello. I Anna Trujillo. Hi, Anna. I am Mr. Carlos Lopez. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Excuse me, is she Miss Diana Andrade? No, she isn't. She's Mr. Diana Ilar. She is the manager of the company. Okay. And are you the supervisor? No, I am not. I am a sales person. Thank you so much, Mr. Lopez. Nice. Thank you. Hey, listen, I, I hear the, the Erica, your voice is like, you know, like you are in the airport, right? Uh, ladies and gentlemen, the flight to Canada is in this moment in gate number three, okay? <laughs> yes, very good. So thank you, Erica and, and Abigail. Thank you so much. Good voices, good, beautiful voices and good pronunciation. Nice. Good. Now let's go to the next part. And here we have two questions. Look, uh, is Mrs. Diana Diana Aguilar is Mrs. Diana Aguilar the manager of the company, and are Anna and Carlos supervisors? So you're going to say yes, she is or no, she isn't. Uh, yes, they are or no, they aren't. Right? The manager of the company and super supervisor. Good. Okay, volunteers, please. Question one, volunteers, hands up. Yes, Delia. Is Mrs. Diana Aguilar the manager of the company? Yes, she is. Of course, yes, she is, right? The manager, mm -hmm. nice. And Melba, please, question number two. Are Anna and Carlos supervisors? No. And no, they? Anna and, no, they aren't supervisor. Good. Oh no, Anna and Carlos are not, right? There are many options, Melba. Thank you. Thank you very much. Good. Now let's go to the last. Uh, yes, okay. Uh, the last. We already practiced this. Ya practicamos esto, entonces vamos al ejercicio. Okay. Yes. 
the exercise, right? Let me see, who's going to help me? Uh, Jonathan, please. Jonathan, let's go to the question. Jonathan, is she Jessica? No. Para ahorrar, Jonathan, pues no vamos a escribir, ¿verdad? Porque aquí tengo que usar la función de escribir y nos tardamos un poquito. Así que de un solo vamos a la respuesta. Ajá, Jonathan, ¿y Chi, Jessica? No, it's not. No, Chi. No, Chi. It's not. No, Chi is not. No, Chi is not. Chi. Chi. Oh. Yeah. She are or she is? She is. She is. Very good. Thank you. No, she's not. She's Linda. Nice. Now, let me see. Uh, uh, Naum, please make the question to Jonathan in the number one, please. And Jonathan, you answer, please. Teacher Naum Bonilla wrote in the chat and... Uh, okay, sorry. Eh, José es, está manejando, ¿verdad? Yeah, but, but Naum, Naum is... There's something else. Off, off it. He has, he has a, he has a problem with, with her, with him computer. With his computer. Okay. Uh, mm -hmm. No, I don't, I don't get it. I, I'm checking the, well, anyway, but thank you for the information. Thank you. So, so he's, he's not going to participate. That's it. So, um, and then, uh, JC, please. JC, you made the question to Jonathan. Number one. JC? Okay. Number one, make the question to Jonathan, please. And Jonathan is going to be letter B. JC, A, Jonathan, B. Number two, number one. Number one, number one. Is she, is she Jessica? Jonathan? Mm, she is. No, 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 Jonathan, the same answer, right? Lo mismo que me dijo hace rato, Jonathan. No. No. Uh, no, she is no. not. No, she's not. She? No, she's not. She is Linda. Very good, thank you. Now, number two, please. Uh, JC? Number two. Is a manager. Ajá, uh -huh. but the answer, look, is I. ¿Qué dijimos cuando yo pregunto y la respuesta es I? ¿Cuál, cuál pronombre utilizo, JC? Si me preguntan y yo respondo con I, ¿cuál es el sujeto? ¿Cuál es el sujeto? Is. Mm. Is. Are a manager. No, no, ok, wait, wait a minute. Le vamos a ver aquí. La, la, pre, la primera pregunta sería Are. Vamos are a, a manager. Are they or are you? Are you? Are you ah, a manager? Very good. Are you a manager? Yes. Yes, I am. Yes, I am. Good. Remember that in this context, it's not correct to say, yes, I'm, right? No contraction when it's affirmative, short answer, right? Good. Now, uh, minor, uh, make the question and JC, the answer, right? Minor is A, JC is B. Please hit Thomas. No, no, sorry. Number two, es que dije la tres, pero sorry, excuse me, man, no lo perdí. Excuse me. And number two is number two. Uh, you are a manager. 
Are you a manager? Yes, I am. Okie dokie. Thank you. Thank you. Now, minor. Number three, minor. Is he Thomas? Uh huh. Yes or no? Yes, he is. Uh, no. No. Uh -huh. No, he is. He isn't. No, he isn't. Or no, he's not, right? He? He is Jose. Nice. Now, please, Melba, you made the question letter A and minor letter B. Okay. Perdón que no esté escribiendo, pero por el tiempo, porque necesito sí. otro material. Okay, come on, okay. Melba. Is he Thomas? No, he is, and he is Jose. Okay, nice. Better impossible, mejor imposible. Thank you, thank you. Now, Melba, please. Uh, number four. Are they Francisco and Alan? Yes. Yes. They are. Good. Now, Monica, please make the question letter A and Melba letter B. Are they Francisco and Alan? Yes, they are. Okay, thank you. Now, Monica, number five, please. Uh, are you Marcela and Carla? No, we. Uh, no, we. Ay, me ves. Okay, what, what is the negative for we? We isn't or we aren't? We, we isn't. Mm -hmm. We aren't. We aren't. Okay, no, we aren't. Continue. Uh, are Maria and Camila. And so in this context, what is the subject? What is the sujeto? They. Mm, no. Porque mm. la pregunta es, are you? ¿Son ustedes Marcela y Carla? No, no somos Marcela y Carla. ¿sí? ¿Nosotros somos? ¿Cómo decimos nosotros somos? De, no. No, no, no. Vale, ok. Esta parte es de las más, diría yo que es de las más difíciles cuando hacemos preguntas. Cuando yo pregunto con, are you a doctor? Por ejemplo, are you a doctor? Yo contesto, yes, I am. O no, I am not. ¿Sí? Porque solo soy uno. Are you? Sos tú. Uh -huh. O eres tú. Ok. Pero si yo digo, son ustedes, son ustedes Marcela y Carla, entonces vamos a contestar siempre con, ah, sí, nosotros somos o nosotros no somos. Entonces sería, si pregunto con you, respondo con I, en singular. Y si pregunto con you, en plural, respondo con we. ¿Ok? Entonces ya tenemos aquí, are you Marcela y Carla? No, we aren't. ¿De ¿Cuál sería aquí entonces, Mónica? We are María y Camila. We are María y Camila. De, very good. Thank you. Now, please, eh, Nicole, make the question in number five. And Mónica, the answer. Letter B. We, we are you, Marcela and Carla. No, 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 no. Look. No, we aren't. The question. Nicole, you the question. And Monica, the answer, right? Are we, you, Marcela, and no, Carla? No, wait, wait. Are, are? Are you, uh -huh. Marcela, and Carla? Like a question. Ahora como una pregunta. Are you, Marcela, and uh -huh, Like this. Are you, Marcela, and Carla? No, we aren't. We are Maria and Camila. Okie dokie, thank you. Very good. Gracias, me ayudaron a salir de la toalladera porque eso estaba difícil. That, that was hard, that was hard, yes? Okay, that's it, right? We finish? What time? Oh, exactly, yes. Les tenía un material ahí bien bonito, pero lo vamos a hacer mañana. Hay, hay unos ejercicios de listening, 
están pero súper ahí para, para esta parte del verbo to be. Así es que, um, no sé si hay alguna pregunta antes de terminar. ¿Any question? ¿Todo está bien? Acepto sugerencia, no hay problema. Yes. ¿no? Ajá, dígame. Tell me. All right. Ah, uh, oh, everything is, is good. Ok, todo está bien. No pensé que me iba a hacer una pregunta. Ok, good. Eh, vamos a tomar lista y esta noche necesito quedarme 10 minutos extra con Débora. ¿Está bien, Débora? It's ok for you? Yes, teacher. Yes, ok, ok. Thank you, Débora. Aquí la estamos agendando, ok? Nice. Eh, no se le olvide, por favor, que le voy a enviar... Eh, los PowerPoint al grupo, así que véanlo. Y también les voy a... Bueno, este día no envío un video, porque todos los días envío un video, pero eh, mañana se los voy a enviar, de, o quizás más noche, sí, de una canción. Los días jueves envío una, una letra de una canción para que practiquen, ¿sí? Así que se las, se las debo ahora o mañana, cualquiera de los días, ¿sí? Ok. Eh, eh, Alessandro, please, me manda el mensaje. Eh, Ivonne. Present. Okay. Have a good night, Ivonne. Bye bye. Good, good night. Okay, Deborah. I'm here. Okay, good. So wait for me. Wait for me. And okay. Delia. Okay, Delia. I'm here, teacher. Good. Thank you. Bye bye. Bye bye. Good night. Good tomorrow. Thank you for your help. Eh? No. You're welcome, teacher. Good. Edwin. Bye. 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 Hi. See you. Have a good night, Edwin. Good night. Good night. Lupita, me manda el mensaje, Lupita. Ok, Erika. Good night. Ok, good night. Abigail. Present. Ok, bye bye. Saludos a la princesa. Ah, no, Elizabeth, la que tiene la princesa. Ahí. Ok, Elizabeth. Present, bye. Ok, bye, bye, bye. Jonathan. Hi, teacher. Ok, have a good night, Jonathan. José, José va manejando. Aquí le vamos a poner asistencia, José. Va manejando. Naum, tu problemita, ¿verdad? pero no sé si ya está. Present, contado. present. Ok, present. good. Thank you, Naum. Thank you. Good night. Good night. Bye bye. bye. JC. Present. Good. Minor. See you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. Present. Good. Eh, Minor, See mañana va a estar con nosotros o, o sí, va a estar sí. trabajando. Sí, me voy a estar en la clase. Excelentoso, Minor. Thank you. Thank you. See you tomorrow. Melba. I'm here. Good. Have a good night, Melba. See you. See you. Monica. Present. Good. Bye bye. bye. Nicole. Bye. Nicole. Good night, teacher. Good night. Good night. Oscar. Good night, teacher. Oscar. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Okay. Roberto. Robert? I am here. Good okay, night. good. Good night. God bless you. See you tomorrow. See you. Yari, no sé si logró conectarse al fin, Yari. Yes. yes. Good okay. night. Good night. God bless you. Eh, and, eh, José, José, ya le puse asistencia. No se preocupe. Puede manejar ya tranquilo. <ríe> y Emerson. Emerson. Yeah. Okay, bye bye. Cuidado ahí en la carretera, eh. Good night, good night. Good night. Bye bye. Y aquí tenemos a Alessandro y a Lupita. Thank you. Have a good night, Alessandro y Lupita. Ya les tomé asistencia. Thank you very much. Okay. Débora, how are you, Débora? Hi, teacher. How do, you like, how do you like the class? I like it. Oh, good, but, good. Uh-huh. You, you would like that we speak 100% English, right? Uh, um, I would like to improve my pronunciation, I guess. Really? Hey, listen, yesterday I sent some videos in the in the group, right? Did okay. you check them? Uh, no, no, I no, no. just I just saw one, watched it one. Oh, good. This one is really long. Let me, let me see. Let me... I, I, I don't... Just... Let me see. Uh, the name of the video is. Uh, well. Oh no! I I oh. I I I check it, but in the in the in the page. 
No, 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 no. It's, it's, it's grammar. Yes. I, I was supposed to send you a, a video of listening, but no. No, no. I, no. I don't know if you, if you can see it. No, no. I didn't. Okay. I didn't this is it. about bird to be. This oh, no, I didn't see it. Okay. This is about bird to be. So okay. if you have time, please try to check it, right? Okay. Now, about the class of today, do you have any question? Something you didn't uh, understand? No, everything is okay for me. I, I imagine, I imagine. Uh, I, I see, I imagine that this, this topic is really easy for you, right, Deva? Maybe just this topic, but I, I don't know. Uh, the other ones. Uh-huh. Yeah. Well, sometimes it happens, I don't know if it's your case, but sometimes it happens that you speak very well. You understand it very, very well too, but the grammar is a problem sometimes. I don't know yeah, if, if it is. this is your case, Deborah. Mm, maybe when I refer to she or, or he, uh -huh. I forgot the, the when, I, when I have to use uh, his or her, I forgot, okay. but basically i i understand good that's nice and i imagine you 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 also have problems to understand when in simple present for example when say they work in the company and she works in the company right yeah oh good so we're going to see that in the in the next unit but but i, I will take in account that that sometimes you have problems in this part right no, I don't know if you want to check any other topic. Mm. Something that you say, ah, I always wanted to, to learn about this topic. Well, I, I think I understand the simple present. Mm -hmm. um, I was I was a study studying English in other in other uh, university. Nice. And where where they were, sorry to ask. I don't know if you if you know about uh, Senuet. Oh yes, of course. Uh huh. My sister works there. She's a teacher. Oh really? Yes. Uh, her name is uh, Sandra Dalila. Uh, she she. Sanchez. Corlin. She has a curly curly hair. No 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 no. no. It's, uh, it's a straight I, hair. I, I, well, but well, I'm sure there are many teachers there. But yes. Yes, I know the place. It's a good place. Come on, it's a good place. Yeah. Yes. yes, and it, and it is ship. I know I it's because it's supported by sponsored. It's cheaper by than than others. It's a sponsor than uh, from from the US, of course, right? Uh huh. Mm -hmm. Okay, good, and and that's it, right? And uh, one of the things that I know because I I have never been there, but because of my sister, I heard that uh, they tried to to make the students speak. Uh-huh. I, I had a problem with when someone asked me. I understand when you are talking with me, but mm -hmm. I had a problem to, to think and to say what I am thinking. Mm -hmm. It's easy because you're sometimes trying to translate into Spanish. <laughs> yes, that, 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 that's my problem because mm -hmm. I, I try to translate how to say this in English when I am thinking in Spanish. I and know. I yes. I think it's my big problem, but okay. uh, I have I had problem with a present progressive. Oh, uh huh, yeah. and that's the reason why I am I am study English again because I would like to improve it and I would like to to review some topics, right? Yes, and to to be more fluent. Nice, 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 nice. Good. So uh, in in this course, I will send you many videos. So uh, I suggest you 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 watch them. Yesterday I sent, for example, right, uh, three sites in the internet. One is for uh, it, it has everything: grammar, listening, reading, music. Okay, I cannot say the name because you know uh, we they are recording this video, so. But but is in the in the group, and the mm -hmm. other side is uh, for grammar. Mm -hmm. This is exclusive and, and it's really good with grammar, right? And and it includes some tests and some quizzes. So the way you can write, mm -hmm. and they give you a, if you're right or wrong, you know. Okay. So that's that's it. I mean, you can practice. And the last one that I sent yesterday is with music. 
You know, Debra, that music is, well, in my case, in my personal case, that's the way I learn, you know, you know with music. Yeah, yeah. I, I, uh, in my case, I love to, to listen to music in English. Nice. Uh, my my co-worker Lupita said you always uh, listen English music yeah because I love because I and sometimes I can uh, learn more uh, things or, or, or improve my vocabulary that's nice with uh -huh. grammar sometimes you know it, it's a problem because they, have, they use a lot of slang in, in music yes or, or sometimes, sometimes they say for do. example she don't she don't like it for example but uh -huh. in general, you you learn a lot. Maybe if you if you listen to all music, you can you you are able to understand more than if you uh, listen to Lady Gaga, for example. Yeah, I hate it. Uh -huh. <laughs> yeah, of course. Yeah, the you know my music because you know I'm I'm from the eighties. <laughs> yeah, but yeah, um, it's it's my favorite they, music, yeah, and it's it's really romantic and, and then but Coldplay. Hopefully it's easy to understand the music. Of course, yes, uh -huh. and it's nice. And, and you know I love mm -hmm. I I love electronic music, oh, and nice. Coldplay is one of the my best singers. Uh huh. One of your best band. But my favorite one is U2. Have you heard about U2? Bono. Uh, uh tell me. The stone what? twins I... in your eyes. See, no, no. With mm -hmm. or without you. No, with or without you. No, I, I can't hear you. <laughs> okay. Yeah, it's it's because it's, it's kind of old music, you know, but it's good. Well, in fact, Bono was in El Salvador during the Civil War. And the, the singer of, of the group. He was uh, in Osama. What year? He was in the 80s. Oh, really? Bono, Bono was in the 80s. Uh, he was an ambassador from the UNICEF. In bus? Oh, uh -huh. I, I, I didn't know. But 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 uh, they are from Ireland, Ir Ireland. Yes, uh -huh. Bono in in the group U two. Well, uh, but my recommendation is this: uh, they were, if you have a printer, yeah, try to print the the, the lyrics right, and you yeah. stick the lyrics. I don't know in in the refrigerator, for example, on the re refrigerator, uh -huh. or on your bedroom. And then you listen to the song and try to. Uh, I, I, well, That's when I know. have a free time, I usually use Spotify. Oh, nice. And you can able to, to see the, the light. I don't know how do you say letras. No, how do lyrics. you pronounce lyrics? Lyrics, uh -huh. the lyrics. lyrics on Spotify like, like this. Uh, let me show you. Uh, let me see, let me see. Like this. Oh, uh -huh. wonderful, yes. It's like karaoke and at the same time you listen yeah. to the song. Uh -huh. Yes. It is. It is. Well, I used to have a Spotify, but a lot of a lot of advertisements. So <laughs> I said, no. Right. <laughs> but do, do you have the original account? No. <laughs> oh, okay. No words. I won't say anything. I want pirates. Uh -huh. <laughs> okay. But yes, with music. And the other recommendation, Deborah, is uh, movies, right? Uh, Peter, when I when I watch in a movie in English, I you try to translate, right? No, I put a, a subtitles. Nice. And but in English, I, sometimes I feel very very good because when I am uh, listening and and writing, mm -hmm. I understand maybe fifty percent the, uh, really? the movie is saying uh-huh but my very my my big problem is how to express my ideas okay yes mm -hmm. but try to not think in spanish right and uh the this exercise watching movies will help you just to think in english right keep your mind just in english so uh uh, that's my recommendation. L like uh, a movie every week, if you have the time. Is is it to understand uh, um, cartoons? Cartoons. I recommend yeah. cartoons, uh, romantic movies, romance, and comedies. Yes. Action movies, horror movies. Nah, 
No, the, the vocabulary is very different. And, and I know, and they speak very fast. I, I, they speak I, a lot. I, I, yes, I don't. They speak I slang, speak slang, you know, caliche. Yeah, it is. Caliche, uh -huh. slang. So it's, it's not recommended because if you're going to, uh, it's good, you know, some 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 guys from United States, they come, they speak English, right? And they come to El Salvador like, yeah, I speak English very well. But but the, but they speak a lot of slang, you know? And when you speak Sh Sh uh, uh, S H A L L. Oh, no, I don't get it. Sorry. S H uh -huh. A no E no. Let me check. Uh, let me see. What is the word you're spelling? Sorry, I don't get it. S H A L L. I I I I'm going to write in it and in, in my chat. Okay, good. Oh, she, I don't know how do you pronounce. Uh, give me a second. Give me a second. Uh, show. Ah, yes, uh -huh. the model. The model show. Uh huh. I don't know the meaning of. Okay. Oh, it's the same wheel. In the future. It's the same. Yes. Yes. Oh, Shall I? Eight? But the British use more this uh, model. Um, this word. Hey. Show. Uh, hey, that that's slang. Slang. I will explain both. You know, a uh, show is like uh, to make plans or to describe something in the future, right? It's exactly the same use of will. I shall go to the. But I in, will go to formal. the. Or is very formal. I, as I repeat, British use it a lot. Ah. And then, ain't is a slang that is used for. All the sentences that are negative. For example, if mm -hmm. I say I don't speak English, I say I ain't speak English. She doesn't speak English. Ain't speak English. Ain't speak. English. And then only ain't, ain't, ain't. Or the verb to be, for example, she's not a student. She ain't a student. They okay. are not student. They ain't students. Okay. I I I ain't a student, right? Instead of say I am not. So they substitute everything in negative with ain't. Oh, I got it's it. very a uh, very popular slang in, in, in you know, I, I I I saw in a in a movie. In in a movie in in, in music too, right? It's very yes. very common. Yes. Very common. Okay. Uh, ah, the last suggestion also, Deborah. Uh, movies, music, and in in YouTube, you can find some audio books. Uh -huh. Do you like to read? No. <laughs> oh come on. <laughs> well, but anyway, you're not going to read. You're just going to listen, right? It's something like, like this that you, you stay like this, right? And only listen to the to the audio because it's that an audio. And there are some popular books like uh, you know Tom Sawyer, uh, the Prince, El Principito, or the Little Prince. Um, what else? Edgar Allan Poe, the 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 tales of of horror, I guess, uh, Cuentos de Terror. I don't know, but Edgar Allan Poe, you know. And there, there are many books, and even for children, right? So my recommendation, if you have the time and you want to practice, and if you like to read, <laughs> well, least, listen to others <laughs> reading for you. Maybe, maybe listen. <laughs> okay, so uh, audio books in, in YouTube. There are okay. many, many books, yes. And also, well, in, in Netflix, if you have Netflix, you can put the, the subtitle, right? Yes, I, I do. Good, Deborah, so time is over. So, uh, you know, 10 minutes pass like this, right? So I don't know if you have any extra question. No, everything is okay for me. Good, so thank you for helping me in the class, you know, uh, because some students, you know, they have some problems to understand they are kind of, uh, I understand. No, no, I mean, they are not bad. No, they are not bad. They are slow because they. they Everybody are, are learning. I course, understand. Yes. Even me, you know, when sometimes I, I commit some mistakes, <laughs> because nobody's perfect, right? Yeah. So, so teacher, I had a question. Um, when I I start the, the process to mm -hmm. to study English, uh, nobody asked me about uh, what is your love of English. Ooh, that's so and that's good. the reason why I, I am here Basic in the world. Well, yeah. how do you feel? 
Mm, maybe it's easy for me, the simple present. But I, I'm not sure what is the, the program well, would, about it, um, level how, two or three. How to place you in, in, the, in the right level. Yes. Just because, uh, in my opinion, you, will, you, you have to be in at least basic five or basic six, at least, right? But, or intermediate, two, three, One. or four, I don't know. Uh -huh. <laughs> yes. But, um, honestly, they were, uh, I don't know what is the process, but m maybe you can ask, you know, uh, you can tell uh, this is level. Is to change the level? later the, no the the thing is that uh, well honestly I, I i don't know well i don't know i'm not sure what is the process but but you know you can speak i mean you there, there are the telephones there so mm -hmm. you can ask. I, I can ask so my recommendation is this right because this is a, a process of registration maybe you can continue with this level and when so you for do, me, it's good the 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 the, the class. I I, okay. I I love the class, but I'm not sure is. You can move to another level. I suppose uh, yes. I suppose, but what honestly, do you recommend to be here or or maybe ask how can I do to to change? If, if I have the power, I, yeah. I I I will recommend you to move to intermediate. But if you want to review some basic structures in grammar. Can you tell me um, the, I don't know, how do you say uh, los temas? The, the topics. The topics, the to yeah. We're going to develop in this level? Oh, in this level? In this level, only simple person. Uh, the verb to be, the simple present, uh, locations, okay. numbers, the alphabet, uh, the possessive, the... Let me see. There is, there are. There okay. is, there are. Uh -huh. And what else? Uh, yes, basically, those are the topics. A simple present, verb to be. There is, there are. Uh, locations and directions. You know, a prepositions, including prepositions, right? In, on, behind, among, between. Etc. Etc. Right. This is the last unit, unit four. Okay. Those are the topics. Mm -hmm. And and of course, affirmative, negative, and just no questioning. No yeah, topic. but in this case, I'm going to finish the level, of course. Okay, good. That's nice mm -hmm. for me. It's okay because you you're going to help me. <laughs> uh, it's okay. <laughs> yeah. And it's okay. So my recommendation is when you register for the next level, ask and okay. tell. I would okay. like to be in another level, so I, I think I'm, I'm able to uh, I have the skills to, to move to another level. Well, the reason I am here is to help my co-worker Lupita too. Ah, okay. Yeah. No, but she, she is. I mean, she yeah, answers. Too. Yeah, she's good. Yeah. Well, I hope she can she can make it with the with the computer, right? Because okay, teacher. <laughs> yes. yes. Okay, Deborah, thank you very much. It was nice Bye. talking to you and congratulations. You speak very well. Yeah. Thank you, yes. teacher. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> so bye bye. God bless you. Bye. Had a good bye. night.